Welcome back, baby, to the franchise. Uh, as many of you know, I made an insane trade for Dalvin Cook. The team's looking a lot different, but we still have Mac Jones, DK Metcalf, and it's week eight versus the Bears. So we have a little back-to-back -back versus the Bears here. I had a bye in week seven. So as you can see, the NFC North is actually looking interesting. Jake whooped my ass, bro. So Jake the Packers whooped my ass 27 to 10. Since that, he lost the last two games. He's now six and two. I'm four and two. The Vikings are four and four and the Bears are four and three. So week eight is the Bears. Week nine is the Packers. If I win both of those games, I'm actually leading the NFC North because I will be six and two and the Packers will be six and three. That's assuming I win that game. If I lose, let's say I win today and I lose Packers, I'm five and three. Packers are seven and two. So it'd be really tough to win the NFC North if I don't beat the Packers in week nine. After that, I have the Giants who went to the playoffs last year. The Cowboys went to the playoffs. The Jets who won the Super Bowl and the Saints who almost beat me. So it's an insanely difficult schedule these next few games. I'm going to check the Bears lineup real quick, just in case he made a trade. Quentin Nelson, Hayward, Denzel Ward. No, he just still has a really good defense. Doesn't look like anything else is like particularly changed. Okay. He's coming off the loss from me. I don't know what happened to him last week. I don't remember his record. So let's just play this standard. All right. So defensively, he did hit me on some deep bombs. He hit me on some medium too. I'm just going to go with short though. Play against the checkdowns. Jared Goff is not that good of a quarterback. So I'm okay if he tries to throw low. Offensively, I kind of want to throw it deep. I said that as if I don't, as if I don't choose to throw it deep every single time. Weekly game plan goal is going to definitely be passing because we got to get Jamison Williams like where we want to get him. Let's throw two plus touchdown passes. Let's not allow a rushing touchdown. Pass for 275 plus and win the turnover battle. I didn't win the turnover battle last time. I played like shit last week against the Bears. It was so embarrassing. So we need to seriously step it up this week. Okay, I feel good about everything though. We understand like we understand how to play against the Bears. I need to be a lot smarter with the football throw better passes need to get jamison williams 150 receiving yards and hopefully some touchdowns let's have a good game crib lines berries on sunday prime time uh-oh hey good luck crib let's have a good game bro last game was a great one let's try and get another one franchise if i can kick off i'm feeling real good here i am 3-0 against the bears but they have all been good games Yes, I'm kicking off. Let's go. But I am in his stadium. He's got the momentum. I don't know what it is right now. It's called Bear Down. Oh, shit. It's Kenneth Walker. No, Kenneth Walker, don't you dare return a kick on me. <laughs> I would be so depressed. All right. Away team's kicking meter moves faster on the downswing. Shit. Okay, so my kicking meter my kicking meter moves slower. Jake changed his team a lot, apparently. He was telling me. He was like, bro, look. Oh, Aluakon's in. No adjustments. He's in. That's huge. Ooh, huge hit. Was that Daxton Hill? Who made that hit? God damn. Hey, Kenneth Walker fumbled opening drive last time, and that was like exactly how. We were just rocking him. I'm sending a little bit of heat here. He might throw halfback. Oh, good pass. We should be able to tackle him. I left that completely wide open, trying to sell out for the blitz and get him down to fourth down, and did not pay off. Well played by Crib. I'm going to have the middle ready just in case, though. He faked the snap. He is going with it. Oh, I just missed with Bates. Yikes. We know this is a pass. Kirk Cousins is in. The dig's not there. Oh, he barely got rid of that ball. Third and six. Right, I'm going to go on Jordan Whitehead here. Okay, he's going to check down. Great tackle. Spectacular tackle. That's a fourth and six. He will take the field goal. I respect it. Get some points up on the board first. Last time on his opening drive, he got no points. He actually, yeah, he fumbled. So this is a better start for him than last time. Does he drill it? Absolutely. And honestly, that's a field goal I don't think I can make because he has that bear down thing, that momentum. Away team's kicking meter moves faster. I'm too scared to make a kick like that. I'm very much hoping that I don't put myself in a position where I have to kick a field goal. Still a great play. Actually, for eight yards right there, but it is a rush. Damn! That sucks. Was very, very much hoping that that would be considered. Mm, but if I block James Mitchell here, I might have Dalvin. Yep. Exactly what I wanted. Um, Weird play, but I'm going to try this. Play action. Let him come across. Throw it away. Let's be smart. Wait a minute. I have a feeling this is going to really work. Wait, watch this shit. Wait, he, he's gonna fucking fly to this dude. <laughs> oh, I didn't get a very good block there. Zone fake jet. Actually a nasty play. Could have gone a lot better though. I just, that blocking was kind of weird. Let's see how this looks. 
Dalvin outside. Beautiful. What a play. What a throw from Mac Jones. Because if I lead that inside, I'm picked off. I'm fucking sweaty. Look at my new playbook. Look at my new playbook, bruh. Okay, second and inches. He's open. The only reason I'm throwing that is because I desperately need Jameson Williams yards. I need 150 with him. I've got none right now. The touchdown does help him a lot, though. He's got to be wide open here, doesn't he? Oh, whoop. Getting receptions. Not really any yards. Second and nine. Let's see if he takes James Mitchell. He doesn't. Jameson Williams. Fuck it. I'm sending it. Let's go. I don't want a field goal right now. He calls a timeout, actually. I feel like this close, I should be able to hit this. Like, it doesn't matter how shitty the meter's gonna be, right? On the downswing, it's faster. Holy fuck! <clears throat> that goes so fast. I literally said it, too. I was like, I can't kick field goals against this fucking thing. <laughs> Shit. Oh, that came in fast. All right, got to make up for it. Oh, uh, peak zone bubble? A variation of it. Ooh, he's hoping for a bigger hit. Weirdly low pass. Zero to three against Chicago right now. I really want a touchdown before half. Second and ten. We keep playing good defense. We can win the bowl game. I see the halfback. I'm running with the halfback. Let's go. Uchenna and Wosu with a sack. Third and 11. Good play. Went ahead. No downswing nonsense. IRL. Okay. A little bit lucky of a catch, but it's fourth and five. Fourth and four. Okay. He didn't go for these last time, and I think he lost the game because he didn't go for it. So I expect him to go for this. Bingo. All right, Cribbo. He's out of bounds! Let's go! Great defense! Had everything clamped. Tries to make a throw on the run. And he's not there. Two minutes and nine seconds left. Gotta get a touchdown with Jamison Williams. Haven't thought about how we're gonna do it yet. Honestly, Henderson is in. How does this happen? I thought I subbed him out of everything. How the fuck is Henderson in? Whatever. First and ten. I'm throwing Jamison. Ooh. He knew I was throwing Jamison. What do I tell you? They fucking triple team Jamison when they know that Jamison's getting the yards. God damn it. That's so annoying. All right. It was a bad pass, though. And I did this last time, too. I still think I'm playing better than the first time I played the Bears. So. He was literally triple team. It's kind of my fault for throwing the ball. Yeah, triple team. Return to center, Cribbo. Ooh, but Wesse Bates! Jesse! Ooh. Wait, that didn't just happen. Jared Goff did not just ankle bite her. Whatever. Although mine was a horrible pass, his was a decent pass. It's just that Jesse Bates is really good. Let's see who he takes here. What do you know? His user's on Jamison Williams. What a throw, Mac Jones! Beautiful play. I go no huddle. He calls a timeout. Does not like what he sees. First and goal. I'm going to motion Jamison Williams. So Jamison Williams' yards are more important right now. Look at that. Look at him floating his user all the way over to Mr. Williams. I'm going to try and roll out left. Make that throw a little bit easier. Jamison. Wide open! <clears throat> no way you're you're taking you're supposed to take that into the end zone jameson it was jameson williams touchdowns it doesn't say jameson williams passing touchdowns Ooh, what a play fourth and goal i go no huddle he calls a timeout fourth and goal all right if jameson williams is not there i gotta look let's just see what happens dalvin in the middle I can't believe Jamison didn't get in earlier, and I'm trying to force it so hard. I'm just not throwing. I just could have done so many things for a touchdown. I got to stop trying to force it so hard, dude. Let's see what he does here. Oh, he's throwing. Fine. <laughs> All right, I'm done messing around, bro. I I'm done trying for Jamison Williams. I'm going to lose the game if I keep doing this shit. Do I even try a PAT attempt? Is, the is it that hard to kick? I'm not going to try a PAT attempt. It's probably that hard to kick. Two-point conversion. I'm going to try something unorthodox here. I'm going right up the gut. Wow, nice blocking, gentlemen. You're trying. What kind of excuse of a block? Did you see three D linemen all black shed at the same time? Because that's what I saw. Six to three. All right, let's see if we get a little, uh, a little bit of pressure. I'm not really sure what he's going to try and do here. I don't know if I've seen him in bunch before. 
I don't think I have. That's kind of open. That was kind of open, but it's so difficult for Jared or Kirk Cousins to make that as a throw on the run. That's just so hard for him to do. Ooh, I kind of saw that coming. He's got to go no huddle. Same thing might be open. He's got 40 seconds now. He's going to go low. Probably get out of bounds. Yep, stop the clock. Get a yard. I respect it. All right, we know this is a pass. Okay, the halfback corner routes. Let's go! Fourth and 10. I think he punts this. Rattled O-line. Home team has trouble blocking. Well, the momentum's working in my favor now, I'll tell you that. I really do think he punts this. No punt. Savage. I respect it. Oh, shit. Thank God I called a timeout. My defense looks so piss poor right there. Oh, he comes out of five wide. Fourth and 10. Just got to make a massive play here, boys. Halfback. And the tight end. Beams one up. Oh my God, he almost caught that. But Jesse Bates with another breakup. Jesse Bates has been amazing. We get the stop that we needed. We're in position to actually 19 seconds, one timeout. I burnt a timeout trying to make a defensive adjustment, so that's no good. And field goals are gonna be really, really, really hard. We already know that. Okay. Oh, bad pass. I got bailed out a little bit right there. That was a stupid pass. I'll just take Dalvin, take a timeout. Third and four. Holy shit. So he has to be, he has to have the momentum bar for that. That's huge. That's huge. All right. We got a field goal back on the board. Nine to three. Three seconds left in the game. That's big. I guess I could just start throwing bombs at DK. Make him fucking respect Jameson. But like, I'm going to switch it up completely right now. Freedom up a little bit, I guess. Ooh, Okay. We'll take 10 clean yards with Jamison Williams. This should leave James Mitchell wide open. Wow, he fell off of Jamison. I did not expect him to fall off of Jamison. All right, we're just going stretch alert bubble. I'm handing this off to Dalvin Cook. Keep it simple, boys. Dalvin Cook's having a good game. Good in the receiving game, good in the passing game. I'm tempted to throw one to DK. Oh my God, James Williams is butt fucking naked. <laughs> what a play. We only have 116 passing yards though, and all of those are not James Williams. So that's a big play. I have no offensive touchdowns, by the way. No offensive touchdowns? Hello. James Williams, wide open. Beautiful. Beautiful. Take it to the seven. All right, we're, we're starting to move the rock, and James Williams is a part of that. Not sure what I want to do here, but I do want to double team on this end so I can get out there to James Dude, I love double teaming a guy. I love double teaming him. That's so fucked up. Double teams are useless. I just double teamed Rashawn Gary. Beauty. Oh, I tried to get sticky. If I gotten sticky there, I might've had the touchdown. Third and goal. That season. That season! Jamison Williams! Back in the end zone! 15 to 3, 12 point game. Let's make it 14. Big time. Big time catch. Huge catch by Jamison Williams. I was so proud of him. All right, this is a DK Metcalf fucking money throw right here. And I'll have Jamison Williams on the other side just in case. Wait for it, wait for it. Push off. Money. Can't guard him in man. You just can't guard him in man, baby. Crib second and eight. He's going to look tight end. Ooh, wait a minute. Levi Wallace. I knew he was looking tight end. I have no idea how Levi Wallace made that play, though. That was disgusting. Fucking love Levi Wallace, bro. Holy shit, he went over his dome piece. Is it possible to hit James Jameson Williams on this route? Or does he just get completely... What? 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 Is he running? Was that a delayed corner blitz? Dude, he, he blitzed that corner that was over Jamison Williams. Or maybe the play action got him. I don't actually know. I have to run shoe clock now. Keep that in mind. It's a three possession game. I have to run shoe clock. I think Metcalf is still in man. Metcalf is in man. He's so good. He is so good. 22 point game. That's huge. All right, yeah. Three possession game. I have to shoe clock. It's probably going to go. Ooh. Way to stuff Kenneth Walker. I don't want Kenneth Walker going off against me. He's mad that I didn't draft him. 2,000. Oh, shit. Wiley Cox just fucking hammered me. Okay, we're just looking for low passes. Oh, I was just about to say that. It looks like 
Oh, boom! Oh, I was thinking Daxton Hill. See, this has been my games versus Crip. He plays really good defense against me, but he really does struggle to get like a pass game going. And if we can bottle his run game, which we have so far, oh, I almost just lurked in with Leonard Williams. Oh, peaks on bubble? Oh. Wait, not Billy and Fuller, bro. <gasps> what? Wait, I thought I had that ball. What? Okay, we got to clamp the run. He's, he's running it. Oh, he's not. Shit. Hatback's so open. Shit. Dude, that was fucking my Will Fuller. That's so depressing. Dude, it really be your own people. Like, it really be your own people. He's running this. That's the stretch. He's ran this before. Oh, it's a dive. It's a dive. It's a dive. But we're there. Let's go. Good stop. Remains a 16-point game. Okay, I'm interested to see how this play sets up this time. What I was gonna look for was Metcalf. See, okay, so I assume that's how it's probably supposed to set up. Ooh, there's a flag. What's the flag? Illegal contact. And I will just tee one up to Jamison Williams or DK. Roll out right. Dalvin. Holy shit, you aired that out way too far. <laughs> I, almost had a, I almost had a chance to get my mitts on that. Bro, that was supposed to be a laser beam. I don't know why he fucking chucked it. 12 receptions, 152 yards, Jameson Williams. He's 152. I can't believe he has 152, really? Third and six, he's probably going to be looking at Jameson. Yes, sir. There's DK, our meaty boy, who's very mad that he has literally no yards today. <laughs> okay. I'm gonna try and get Jamison Williams a touchdown so that it can have the multiplier. Also, I need to, he needs to be honest. He is not respecting DK Metcalf right now. No, not at all. And I need to go down at the two. See, he's not disrespecting DK. DK is just too open for it. First of all, I gotta get the touchdown. Jamison, though. Money. Oh, Crib, did you give it to me? I don't like that. I'm really happy to get the Jameson the shot, but I think he gave that to me. Unless he really thought that was a run play, I think he might have given that to me. Ooh, bad pass. Whoa. <laughs> and he dropped it? Holy shit. Mac Jones really turned this game around. First half was looking poverty, but we're 18 for 25, 300 some, 200 some yards, and a touchdown. I do now, if I get the ball back on offense, I have to shoot clock. Although, I'm not going to lie, the fact that I've been looking Jamison Williams and not DK so much, and then I can pull DK out of the bag is kind of crazy. It's kind of what he just did with William Fuller. I haven't seen him do that at all, so I just like, no, I didn't expect it. And then all of a sudden, he beams Will Fuller, and he gets 40 yards. He's going to go halfback, I think. Oh, nice throw away. Uh, we have film study, so we can see this one. Yep. He's going to run it out. Fourth and nine. We'll see what he does for the final play of the game. Big punt. Probably going to get decent field position. Oh, my God. Punt dot. And he can chew clock with it. That was a dot. All right, eight seconds on the clock. Basically, I have one play left. I'll just try and get Jamison or DK some nice little yards here. So whatever we do has got to be pretty legit here. I like that. Get James Mitchell some yards before the game's over. Add to uh, Mac Jones. All right, boys. Hey, GG's to Crib. Massive game. That's kind of my tail of the tape versus the Bears, dude. He plays such good defense on me, but he struggles mainly because his, te his team is so defense top heavy. He's got like an 88 overall defense and I think a 79 offense. So it's tough for him to score, but if I'm able to, I will come out with the win. We squeaked it out in week six and uh, we solidified that it was a worthy dub in week eight. So that's a big game right there. Let's look at the quarterback comparison here. Sunday night, primetime game. So yeah, Mac Jones, an amazing game. 20 for 27, 347. 74% completion, three touchdowns. Granted, he let his foot off the gas a little bit on defense there in the uh, in the second half. But wow, we really turned it around. That first half was looking piss poor. Had an interception, no passing touchdowns. Could not get it going. Rushing Kenneth Walker, bottled him up. Really proud of our boys. And Dalvin Cook, actually, nasty game for Dalvin Cook. Really glad we have him. Those angle routes, had to keep him honest. Three attempts, 23 yards, average 7.6. So great plays there. Jamison Williams! Three touchdowns for Jamison Williams. So we'll get a huge XP multiplier for that. Over 150 yards. So we'll get the XP for that. That's amazing. Tanner Connor at 68. Dalvin Cook, three for 40. So very happy about the Dalvin, uh, the Dalvin Cook pickup. And DK, DK is just a menace, bro. And the fact that I was targeting Jamison, he was still able to come up with some clutch receptions was huge. And I think we got every single goal. Wow. Yes, we did. Jamison Williams, 150 yards, two plus TD passes, turnover battle, 275 plus, and we didn't allow a rushing touchdown. All right, gentlemen, that's it for week eight. Tough game, crucial game next week against the Packers. See if we can turn it around against them.